what's up guys? Today I'm in Norris Cove with my buddy Jared, my fellow dive buddy. Ooh. I've got Sean and Josh, I've got a documentary team that's uh, here with me doing a little story on me. So we're, yeah, like I said, we're in Norris Cove today. It's foggy, super low tide. As you can see, we're gonna get in the water. I haven't been in here probably since last year. So I'm excited to see what's out there, see if anything has changed, see if the, you know, the storms or hurricanes have churned up the sand and uh, hopefully find some cool stuff. And we're gonna do some cleanup as well. And uh, yeah, just have some fun. So hope you guys enjoy this video. I still can't believe you found those. That's, I've walked over this beach hundreds of times. <laughs> I am the documentary now. Holy shit, what is this? That's... That might be someone's glasses. What? No. Glasses? <laughs> nice. Vintage. <laughs> vintage, yeah. Vintage. They might be back in style now. All right, in she goes. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen it. This is so. This is so clear today. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty well. See anything? Yeah. glasses <laughs> see you better days Thank you. 
Hello. What do you got over there? Got my first uh, milk jug. Bud! Jared and I are done the dive for today. We're gonna show you all the stuff we found. Jared definitely got the winners today, so <laughs> let's see what we got here. Why don't we, uh, yeah, I'll just quickly just go through my stuff. We got a big like rubber, uh, I don't know what that is, tube. <laughs> That's nasty. Uh, this one was kind of cool. It's a screw top, but it is kind of aqua in color and it's got some writing on the bottom it says something teacher uh united kingdom i don't know so anyone from england or uk sorry who knows what that is leave a comment it's got a cool shape too it does yeah pretty interesting uh this is a, a shame it's i have an intact one of these but it's an old navy and dairy uh milk bottle top like a creamer and there's another milk bottle top this one is kind of a pretty uh, Art Deco. This one was like a pop bottle at one point. I just like the embossing and various bits of garbage and other more modern bottles. This is cool because it says Halifax on it. Uh, would have been an old stoneware ginger. Um, I've actually found two broken one of these in the same spot. I've never been intact. Um, and I've got uh, <laughs> a pair of glasses. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> you suddenly aged like 20 years. <laughs> You're probably like 40 years old. They're cool again. So, there you go. And uh, that's the little case it was in. We've got an old wine bottle and some more pop bottles here. This would have had a, a label on it as well. Uh, Barbie leg and uh, shoe sole and some more rubber. And uh, yeah, that's kind of it. Plus some more modern bottles over here. But yeah, let's see what Jared's got. So you should show them what uh, you found when you first like walked in. You weren't yeah. even in the water yet. Yeah, we found uh, these two right here. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. That's so just... I had to put on my flippers. Yeah, that's a beautiful like aqua color. Mm -hmm. And uh, that looks like yeah, either like an old wine or shampoo, like maybe a, it's got a crown top, but it's like the shape of it just looks very, it's like different than the other ones. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Cool. But yeah, show me the winner, man. This is the winner. That is wicked. A farmer's Pure Milk Limited Bottle. That makes yeah, me want cool. some milk. 
Yeah, I'm thirsty. <laughs> Maybe chocolate milk. <laughs> and then you got like a pickle or an olive jar. Yeah. So it's, it's just, it's a cool lid. Like, look at the shape of that. That would have had a big old cork top on it. Yeah, it's cool. At one point. And then just like a mason jar. Yeah, here. yeah. but uh, yeah, man, we had a we had a good time out there today, and the fog's rolling in, and the tide's on the way in, so we're gonna get our stuff packed up and go. But uh, thanks for watching this video. We really appreciate it, and uh, yeah, Jared and I are hoping to explore a new spot soon. So we'll see you on that one.